Hey, yo, Justin. <laughs> yo, man. <laughs> yo, man. Matt Hoffa, yo. What's really good with you? What's good with you, bro? I had a video about you like six months ago, basically saying, questioning the new Math Hoffa. The Math Hoffa, and please, y'all, I'm not hating. I ain't no fucking hater. I'm not no pocket watcher. I'm not no crab trying to keep him at the bottom. None of that. I'm just saying. Somebody that is very familiar with Math Hoffa. This new Math Hoffa just is looking so almost like not relating to what's real anymore. I don't understand it. I don't understand it, Math. You want to be the realest podcast. You want to be the realest nigga. You still use the intro song. You know, only rapper you know without a smack rappers and all that. <laughs> it's funny because you're still living off of that dope situation. It is what it is, though. But this new Math Hoffa is just looking like you're not relating to nothing real. You know what I mean? I just seen him address Charleston White disrespect of his two daughters like I'm telling you straight up right now Charleston White you need to watch your fucking self watch yourself because you playing with a lot of people and not because nothing ain't coming back to you means nothing can come back to you because all it takes is that one person that's just not having it and they'll send everything back to you trust me you call out that one person that just ain't tolerating nothing that's it for you. We're going to be RIPing you real soon. The shit, the shit Charleston White said about Math's kids, his two daughters, fucking them in the ass and all of that. And I'm going to be graphic. Fucking them in the ass and raping them and doing all that to them. This is what you want to, you want to violate Math's daughter. And my thing is Math's response to that. His response was just on some like celebrity shit. Like, math has taken a celebrity high road in every situation. Every situation. He's taken all of these situations on a high road like a celebrity would, even though he's addressing them. Celebrities, a lot of them, a lot of times don't address certain things. But his response to what Charleston White had to say was disappointing. I'm going to be real. That's not what I was looking for. Also, the response to China Mac hating ass, that's not the response I was looking for, neither. I was looking for math to at least tell these niggas to go park their irrelevant ass somewhere because nobody give a fuck about none of them. I wasn't even, he couldn't even say that. He's just, for one, the China Mac shit, they was in a live laughing it up with each other or whatever. And then the Charleston White shit, he's just on some shit like, you know, this is what we're doing in the community. Like, he's just, I'm not saying, man, not to be, you know, professional and keep it on a certain level, but the fact that you are responding at all in general means that you feel some kind of way. So why not let it out? Why not speak some real shit? I don't understand why you sit there with, you know, in the response video, I'm only going to address this once. But you addressed it on some bird-ass shit. You ain't really addressed it straight up. I, I wasn't feeling that. Like, throw that video away. For real. You know what I mean? And I'm going to keep it real with y'all. Every time... Math is getting so much numbers, so much high numbers right now. Every time that he responds to one of you niggas, it's just another fat check. Because check the views. Them views is high as fuck. Them views is in the hundreds of thousands. Because them views is in the hundreds of thousands. Because if y'all ain't realize, we have made Math Hoffa that nigga right now as far as getting numbers as soon as he has a video you know what i'm saying so and like i said i'm happy for mad fafa not a hater here in any type of way i like math he's cool you know what i'm saying but math you gotta tighten up you gotta tighten up you gotta you gotta represent yourself still as a man first not a celebrity first like i watch the show nigga i see the flag i see the rainbow flag up in there I seen the rainbow flag in there, man. I see what you're trying to do. When Smart came here and was airing out the industry as far as artists doing signs and the things that you have to do to get the levels, y'all kind of ridiculed Smart and make him look like he was just talking that crazy conspiracy shit. When, when yo ass know it's real, my nigga, math, you know it's real. You know it's real. 
You know what I'm saying? So y'all trying to play stupid, math, you trying to play stupid and all that. It is what it is. Um, you know how to get your platform on the same level as Drink Champs because you and Nori got a little, Nori's your big brother right now in, in that type of field. So, so you know, you following everything Nori, Nori, um, Nori's doing and I'm pretty sure they speak behind the scenes and Nori tell him stuff like, yo, keep it like this, keep it like that, don't do this, don't. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I'm pretty sure Nori's, like, holding Mav's hand and walking him through how this whole podcast shit work and things of that nature. You can clearly see Mav's expert opinion is, like, the junior version of Drink Champs. You know what I'm saying? And they speak behind the scenes. Of course they do. And Nori's putting them on, telling them what to do. Telling them, like, yo, you could, you could probably... The, the, the flag idea probably came from a Noriega. Like, yo, you could do that. Like... You don't gotta you don't gotta represent it or whatever, but you could put it there. Because that is like a symbol to show that you're in a sense trying to get down, trying to get plugged in and connected to that. You gonna fuck math. You're gonna fuck around and lose a lot of people that really support you for real. And you're gonna get that crowd. Now, is that what you wanna do? Do you wanna sacrifice people who really fuck with you from back when you was just rapping in niggas' faces? Or do you want the the mass ocean of traffic of people that don't give a fuck about you? It's just the lane that you're in that's, it, that's making you relevant to them, pretty much, and the numbers that you have in. Is that what you want? Are you another sellout? I don't know. I don't know. That's all I got to say for right now. Thank y'all for listening to another video. It's your boy. Give it up. 100. I'm out.